Body. A violent evening tonight near the Illinois Tech campus. Two teenagers shot near 31st and State. NBC 5's Natalie Martinez has been covering this story all evening long. Joins us live now with the latest. Natalie. Stephan and Allison, we know tonight that the 16-year-old victim was uh, suffering a graze wound to his arm. He is okay tonight. However, a 17-year-old friend of his was uh, shot several times in the left side. He is in critical condition tonight. We spoke to a witness who says it appears to him from what he saw that shooter did not want to miss. A chaotic afternoon on 31st and South State. Steps from classrooms at the Illinois Institute of Technology. Shots fired 31st and State, 3 1 at State. Caller heard about 10 shots fired in the area. Surprising. Kai Shu was speaking to his class when the shooting happened. We were talking with some kind of research, and suddenly I received this message. And I just say, hey, oh, we should be careful because this is really close by. Members of the IIT community started receiving updates at 450. Shots fired near Keating Hall. Six minutes later, suspects fled campus in a vehicle. Police investigating continue to avoid the area. First year here, I'm, yeah, I'm scared as hell, but right now I'm okay. A witness asked us to protect his identity, but tells a harrowing tale about what he saw at the corner of 31st and State as the White Sox game was letting out nearby. It happens real quick. Kid jump out of a front seat, passenger seat, and he uh, just started shooting at these three kids that were walking by. There's 12 shells, and then they found another magazine that wasn't used. So this kid, this kid was really, he, he was out to... Uh, Make sure you didn't miss. This is really close to campus. I mean, I heard of this shooting many times, you know, maybe in, in some areas other than this, but this is really in the campus. Make, makes me feel like, wow, yeah, this is really close to us, so we should really be careful. There was a black Chevy Impala with dark tents, chrome around the windows. Illinois license plate on the front and back. That vehicle possibly involved last week, west on 31st from State. So there you heard on scanner traffic a description of the Chevy sedan that was apparently used in this shooting tonight. Police tell me that they have no one in custody and would like to hear from you if you have any information on this. We're live at CPD headquarters. Natalie Martinez, NBC5 News. Frightening. Thank you, Natalie.